Today, I've got a jaw-dropping tale to share that's both cautionary and concerning. Picture this. Over margaritas at an Applebee's, a 66-year-old school crossing guard, Sarah Jansen, thought she was saving her $1.7 million Redwood City home from foreclosure, but she was about to step into a real estate nightmare. Sarah Anoli sold her home for a mere fraction of its value to a Hollywood actor named Justin Rogers Hall and his partner, real estate agent Tonica Miller. Their scheme, prosecutors say, targeted an older adult in a distressing situation aiming to swindle her out of her home. Hall flipped to the house for nearly a million dollars just weeks later, transferring funds through multiple accounts. Miller even showed up at Sarah's house with a U-Haul, attempting to persuade her to find a new home in Auburn. That's when alarm bells started to ring. Prosecutors filed charges against Hall, alleging he defrauded Sarah and sold her home to an investment firm that tried to evict her. Sarah's lawyer paints her as a kind-hearted, unsophisticated soul vulnerable to exploitation. Hall's defense argues he was merely fulfilling a legal agreement. This story isn't unique. Vulnerable older adults with valuable homes can fall victim to such schemes. In booming areas like the Bay Area, it's crucial to be vigilant. Seniors become targets, especially when faced with property taxes and financial challenges. But here's where it gets bizarre. Amid these dealings, Hall and Miller took a jaunt to Orlando, Florida for a game show appearance. Miller ended up on Deal or No Deal, and an email from Hall hinted at the million dollars they just pulled off. Folks, this case is a stark reminder of the importance of protecting our elders and the need for vigilance in the real estate world. Stay informed and cautious out there, and be sure to follow for more finance and real estate insights. That's all for today. Remember, Knowledge is your best defense. Stay safe, everyone. Thank you.